All right, let's take and get on some crappy today. About to get cashed out, All right? About. Now, we're gonna get on some crappy. Sit this pole right here down on a pole holder right quick. Got him right out there. I got another pole sitting right here. We're gonna take and we're gonna check him out right quick. <clears throat> Make sure we still got bait on this one. We're gonna get on something today. I don't know what we're gonna get on, but we're gonna get on something. We are definitely gonna get on something. Let's take and get this guy back out there. Cause I do got bait on him. It was just double, double checking. Got him out there. The wind, the wind is blowing just a little bit out here and it's kind of hard for me to sit still. But we're gonna do everything we can do to get on a fish is what we're gonna do. Either way, we're gonna get on some. It doesn't matter if the wind's blowing or not. I did have to whoa whoa that's going in the video right there that is going in the video oh my god my phone might have just went in the water oh that is definitely going in the video oh we're about to lower this down that was scary that was scary that is definitely going in the video oh man we just gonna have to keep count look that was scary. <laughs> but that's going in the video. I'm telling you. Oh, man. I thought my phone was gone. That's what I'm recording off of in my phone. And I really thought it was gone. I thought that was a goner. Oh, oh, oh. Got one. Got one. Oh, I don't know what this is. I have no idea what I got right here. It feels pretty big. It feels pretty big. If anything, I don't know what it is. I was about to say, it might have been a, oh, whoa, whoa. Whoa, little buddy. What is, ooh, it's a catfish. I was not expecting to catch no catfish. Check it out. It's a bullhead catfish. I was not expecting to catch no catfish. It's pretty cool. Y'all kind of get behind the scene with my with my camera sitting right there. Where is my pliers? Let's get him unhooked. All righty. take and pick him up my little fish grabbers i don't want him to take and fin me check this out right here i just caught a bullhead catfish ain't that crazy i was out here crappy fishing and a bullhead just hit the cool thing about a bullhead i'm gonna show y'all something cool about them they almost look they well they're actually identical to a uh, flathead i mean they are pretty much identical but this is actually a bullhead i think it's a yellow a yellow bullhead and the uh, back fin right there looks just like a uh, flathead catfish, and everything about them looks like a flathead, but they're not. They're they're double bullhead. Let's check him out. I was not expecting to catch no bullhead. Not out here. I was going after catfish. I mean, <laughs> going after catfish. I'm going after crappy, and uh, we just got on this little bullhead. Check him out. Big old fat belly on him and everything. But we're gonna go ahead and let this guy right here go. I had no idea what that was. I know whenever it hit, it was something big, but I didn't know what it was. That was pretty cool. But I lost my phone. And uh, next thing you know, bam! Good old bullhead hit. I'm out here crappy fishing. You never know what you're going to catch. You never know what you're going to catch when you're out here uh, fishing. You really don't. It's taking slow us down a little bit. I just moved up just a little bit and I need to slow back down. That's where the paddle comes in handy. Set that paddle down, get baited back up again. And all I'm using, all I'm using is little bitty minnows. All right, we'll bait it back up now. <clears throat> Let's take and get back out there again. And we're back out there. And now we sit 
and we wait. We sit and we wait and we wait on fish. Oh, uh-oh. I think I just had a bite. I thought I, thought I did. I guess not. Sit him back down. Thought I had a bite. Trying to find fish is pretty hard, man. I, I'll give it to it. It is pretty hard sitting here trying to find fish and uh, and, and constantly get on them. Um, it, it's a pretty hard thing to do. Sometimes you go and you catch one and then you'll catch another one and then they're gone. And sometimes, you know, you can get on fish back to back. But right now, it don't seem like nothing, absolutely nothing is happening. I mean, it seems like nothing is happening. It seems like all the fish seems like every one of the fish are gone but they're not they're somewhere they're somewhere we just got to get in front of them and we're we're gonna get in front of them because i think i got a bite oh right out of his mouth and he took my minnow Took my minnow. We're just gonna have to bait back up. Bait back up again. Ain't nothing happening. I don't know what happened to all the fish. They're all gone, gone. They're all gone. I think. We got him. We got him. We got him. Oh, let's tighten that drag up just a little bit. Just a wee bit. I believe this is a crappy. I believe this one is a crappy. Oh, with you. Oh, it is. Not a huge one, but it's definitely a crap. <clears throat> that is definitely what we're going after. That look, this little bitty guy. I don't know why they they're just staying this small or like all about the same size. But hey, I don't care. We still out here catching crappy and check that guy out right there. I don't always have to catch big ones, but still, as long as I'm out here catching them. That's all that matters to me. And we're going to throw him back. Throw him back and let him grow. Maybe he'll grow up to be a big one. And I come back out here and catch, catch him when he gets big. Move up just a little bit. And uh, cast back out by where I was at. Let him sit there. See if we can't get on another little, little crack. Definitely might not be a slab, but still. I mean, you know, when you go after a fish and you target a fish and you take, uh oh, uh oh, and you target a fish and you get on them like that right there. Oh, he got off, he got off. No. Oh, he took my minnow too. That's a bad thing about minnow fishing right there. They will take your minnow and you will have to bait back up constantly. But I think I found them. I think I found their little hole where they were at. And if I found their little hole and I cast back over there again and they hit it again, then guess what? We're on a school level. Let's raise that bobber stopper up right there. Just take and try to hurry up and get back over there. All right, we're back over there again. Take this boat right here and move it just a wee bit. Get some of that water off. Oh, yep, yep, yep. Watch this, watch this. Wham! Got him. Got him. Yeah. That's so fun and so cool. I tell you what, he feels bigger too, not unless he's just fighting really, really good. But 
He feels nicer than the last one. Nah, he's just fighting real good. He's about the same size. Check it out. He's about the same size, but hey, look at him. Another cool one. Throw him back. Rehook my minnow right here, just so I know I got a good hook set on him. I think, I think we just found the school of them. I really do. If I cast it back over there, like I just did, I cast it back over there and another one hits, what we're gonna do is we're gonna take my other pole that I got sitting over here on the other side of me and we're gonna cast it over there. And uh, see what happens. And right now I'm using no electronics. I'm using nothing. All I, all I got is my little boat. I got me a camera, my tripod, a trolling motor, my paddle, and just a cork, a minnow, and my fishing poles, and a bait bucket. Ain't nothing happened. Oh, I said ain't nothing happened. There he goes. There he goes. He's got it. He's got it. Oh, right out of his mouth. Right out of his mouth. I should have been quicker. I should have been quicker than that. But no, no, I'm a little slow. I'm a little slow. Cast it back over there again. All right, let's get this other one up. Let's see if I can't get this one up before something hits it. There he goes. It's so hard fishing when a fish wants to keep biting and you're trying to take another pole and get it out over there where they're at. There we go. We got two of them over there now. Sit it down and wait. Well, I had a couple hits. Missed a couple. Caught a couple. Got a couple poles and nothing's happening. Nothing is happening anymore. Don't know where they went. Have no idea. Let's see if we can't go find them, because they're here, but where? I don't know, but we're going to try to go find them right quick. I believe we found them. Oh, and I did. And I did. And I did. Come here, little buddy. Oh, this is a little big guy, too. <clears throat> he is definitely not that big. Check him out. Check it out. Another little crappy. Little bitty guy. Little bitty guy. Hey, still getting on him. I'll throw him back. Take this pole right here. And fix it. We're gonna get cast back out. Take this pole right here and see if we can relocate it just a little bit. Just a little bit of relocation. And we wait again. Uh oh. I think we'll get another hit. Uh oh. No, we're not. <laughs> the court went down, but then it came back up. I don't think he wanted it. Went down and came up, though. I will give it to it. I will give it to it. Today is not the best day of fishing. Today, not today, to be catching fish. But hey, we still got on a couple though. I'm gonna have to roll out like I did last time, just because it's getting late again. And I'm gonna have to roll out. But still though, I still had a good time out here fishing, trying to trying to locate fish. I did get on a couple. Did not think I was gonna be catching a bullhead today, I can tell you that. But, <clears throat> I did get on a couple fish, better than no fish. Sometimes it's hard, sometimes it's easier to get on fish. Uh, I guess today just isn't the best day to be fishing. And I just casted out a jig with a grub on it just to see what would happen. We have took about lost the phone. We've got on a couple fish. I believe we did pretty good. And that's going. That's definitely going in the video of me about dropping the phone in the water because, oh! Whoa, there he goes, there he goes, right there, right there, boys. Boom, got him. Got him, oh yeah. 
Maybe it was a little bit more better day than I thought of, of uh, crappy fishing. Oh, check it out. Boom. There he goes. Bam. That's pretty cool right there. That is pretty cool. Got on another one. Like I said they're all about the same size. And I've tried different dips. I've tried different things to get on them. And for some reason, they're just hitting right there at that one dip and about in the same location. But still, I mean, even though it ain't a big fish, we still getting on fish. And that's the main thing is that we're getting on fish and we're getting on that guy right there. We're gonna take and we're gonna just throw him back. Like, boop, right back in the water. Let him swim free. Swim free, free. We're gonna cast him back out there. Cause you didn't ever take my minnow. Huh? But we're gonna cast him back out there and we're gonna take this jig and we're gonna keep on rolling. All right, we're about to call it. Sun's going down, it's starting to get late. Last time I came out here and fished, what I did was I stayed until it got pretty much dark and I had to load this boat up when it got dark. I definitely do not feel like loading this boat up again while it's dark because I could not see last time. I had no light. I had absolutely nothing to load this boat up, but we're gonna go ahead and leave. Today was a great day. I was crappy fishing, got on a bullhead, which is so cool. We got on a couple crappy, nothing major, nothing too big, but hey, we still had fun. I got out and fish. That's all. That's what it's all about is being able to get out here and fish, whether you catch big fish, small fish, the fish you're going after or not. But I am leaving where I almost dropped my phone in the water. I'm leaving that in the video right there because, oh my God, I thought my phone was going in the water. That would have been really, really bad. If it did, then I wouldn't have been able to make content. I probably would have been swimming. This is what I probably would have been doing because I probably would have went down there to go find it. And I have no idea how deep it is right here. I know it's over four foot because my four foot paddle I was using um i stuck it down in the water and i can't touch the bottom so i know it's over four foot but we're gonna go ahead and we're about to leave we're about to get out of here because it's getting late as you can tell right there the sun is going down but we're about to get out of here and call it a day i appreciate everybody to watch i see everybody on the next one